Good morning, my name is Engineer Piyush Pandey and the topic for today's discussion is the types of audience during presentation. Ladies and gentlemen, we have to give presentations in our official atmosphere or if we are students, then also we have to give presentations related to the projects that we accomplish in our student life. What is the best way of giving a presentation? In simple words, it is impressing your audience. If your audience is impressed, it means you have given a good presentation. This is a simple definition of a good presenter in a straightforward way. Because when you are giving presentation, some people are listening to it. And the people who are listening to it, if they are happy, it means that you have established your credibility as a good presenter. So what defines a good presenter? That whether audience are getting impressed by his presentation or not. So first of all, we need to analyze that what are the different categories of audience during presentation. We have basically four categories of audience. Director, energizer, affable and thinker. Number one is director audience. These are the audience who only want to listen to the main material for which they are sitting in the presentation. They may be the CEOs or the managers of the organization. They may be the heads of departments. And they may be the people who are holding higher designation or responsible designation in an organization. So when such type of people are sitting in a presentation, they know that what is the purpose of presentation, why the presenter is giving the presentation and they only want to know the real important material, the real important thing in reference to which the presentation is being delivered by the presenter. So during your presentation, they only focus on that whether you are discussing main material in your presentation or not. Are you deviating from your actual goal? Are you speaking unnecessary things which are not required according to the topic of the presentation? So these people concentrate on such type of things. They only want what is desirable by the organization. They only want that they should get from the presentation what they truly desire for the benefit of their organization. No extra unnecessary things. These are director audience. Another category of audience is energizer audience. Under this category, we come across people who are majorly school students, college students. The nature of such type of audience is very enthusiastic because majorly they are very young people. They are highly enthusiastic, highly energetic. And while sitting in a presentation, they have a feeling that today we are going to learn something new. Whatever the presenter is going to present, we are going to learn something new out of it. So in a very excited mode, they sit in the presentation. They listen very uh, in a very focused way to the presenter. That yet, yes, what new idea, what new strategy the presenter is going to talk about. This is their mentality. So energizer audience are majorly young people, college students, school students who majorly sit in a presenter in a presentation, sorry, from the point of view of gaining new knowledge. So this is the mindset of energizer audience. Third category of audience is affable audience. Affable audience is an audience which cares for the feelings and emotions of the presenter. During a presentation, affable audience has a feeling in their mind that the person who is presenting the content in front of them, that person has done enough research to prepare that content. That presenter has done enough research to prepare the PowerPoint slides in a systematic manner. And then the kind of props which he is using and the way he is talking to the audience, he has done enough practice of it before coming to the auditorium. So we must respect the presenter. We must respect the way he is delivering the presentation. We must respect the hard work that he has made in order to make the presentation lovable. 
so affable audience has a feeling of humbleness and respect towards the presenter so whenever they are sitting in an auditorium they have this feeling that yes we have to focus on the presenter completely we have to be silent we have to be sincere listeners and we have to listen thoroughly to what points the presenter is making what type of slides the presenter is showing what type of props the presenter is showing and what type of material the presenter wants to tell us they are very affectionate towards the presenter they have a feeling of respect towards presenter so these are known as affable audience and the fourth category of audience is thinker audience thinker audience are subject matter experts of the topic on which you are delivering the presentation they are subject matter experts of the topic on which you are delivering the presentation they know each and everything about the topic on which you are giving the presentation that's why when you are giving the presentation normally it happens that they do not react they thoroughly listen to all the points that you are making during the presentation very sincerely very uh, dedicatedly they listen to the points that you are mention uh, that you are mentioning in the presentation without interrupting you they only focus on what you are speaking what slides you are showing and in their mind based on their own knowledge and experience they try to evaluate that whether you are giving right statements or wrong statements whatever points you have just mentioned whether they are actually correct or not the slides that you are showing in front of them whether they have been made in an appropriate manner or not the kind of props that you are using in a presentation are they actually relevant to the topic of the presentation or not such type of thoughts keep running in the mind of thinker audience and they try to evaluate you when you are giving the presentation they start thinking by looking at them initially you cannot analyze that whether they are happy with your presentation or not why because they are so much focused on your presentation that by their face expression you are not able to identify that whether they are happy they may be happy they may be extremely happy by the way you are presenting the content they may be extremely happy by the slides that you are showing they may be extremely happy by the details that you have mentioned in the presentation but they will never show it on their face by looking at their face by looking at their expressions you cannot identify that whether they are happy with you or not so this is this is the problem with thinker audience and i will not say that this is the problem they are such high level experts that when they start observing something they go deep into it they go deep into it and ladies and gentlemen this should be the nature of every human being i will say whatever you are doing if you go deep into it you will be able to analyze it properly in a systematic way so thinker audience are really great audience so these are the four categories of audience i would like to repeat again the basics of uh, these audience categories number one is director audience the people who are exactly looking for what they want in reference to the projects that are going on inside the organization in reference to the immediate needs of the organization and as i told you uh, under this category come the ceos of the organization the managers of the organization the bosses and owners of the organization they come under the category of director audience they only want to listen the main material and how favorable it is for their organization then comes energizer audience the people who are highly excited and who are sitting in the auditorium uh, thinking that today they are going to learn something new and today they are going to add up something to their knowledge and uh, the people which come under this category are college students school students young people energetic people energizer audience third category affable audience the people who show respect towards the presenter the people who show some kind of emotional attachment towards the presenter who want to give time to the presenter who have this feeling that yes the presenter has prepared the content of the presenter uh, the content of the presentation by his hard work and dedication and we must respect that this is the feeling in the mind of affable audience 
And the last category, which I just told you, thinker audience, they are subject matter experts of the topic on which you are giving the presentation. And before giving any reaction, they try to thoroughly analyze the content of your presentation based on their own knowledge and experience. So these are the four categories of audience. Try to understand these categories. Try to understand the mindset of the people belonging to these four categories. And depending on that, you should prepare your presentation. That's why we say that before going to a presentation, audience analysis is the first thing that you should do. Before analyzing your audience thoroughly, you cannot make presentation properly. Why? Because you have to make the presentation which is lovable by your audience. And how you can make your presentation lovable by your audience? Simply by understanding that what type of audience are going to see your presentation. What is their educational background? What is their professional background? What is their social and cultural background? Try to analyze all these things before going inside the presentation and you will always be respected as a great presenter. That's all for today ladies and gentlemen. I hope that you loved my today's video. Please subscribe my channel ERP Ushpane. Sorry, ERP Ushpane Trainer Beta MBA and please press the bell icon for constant updates. Thank you very much. Have a great day.